guys we're back with some more bill burr why do i do this we're on part four <laughs> so there's your favorite joke <laughs> that's the next question what's your favorite bill burr joke on this special <laughs> yeah let us know the name of the first special we thought we were checking out the first special but obviously we weren't i'm sure if i can look in the comments i can find it but yeah go ahead and drop the name of the first special in there if you guys don't mind like comment subscribe obviously if you guys are ready to go on this whole comedy adventure with us we are new to the comedy world and i think that's why i'm having so much fun and laughing so hard so i hope after we make videos for a couple months we're still laughing as hard yeah but comedy is something that's brand new to us so on our other is... channel we cry a lot so well i do maybe not you but i cry every other movie because you guys request these very i get called a movies. sociopath because i don't cry <laughs> over every little thing but it's uh, good to laugh though yeah. it's really refreshing i'm i'm loving this so right right let's absolutely get into it. let's go just gotta get my shit together man that's basically it started going back to therapy again i just can't i just, <laughs> I just can't do therapy i try i start telling my stories i just start fucking laughing <laughs> <laughs> and then the therapist is always looking at me like, you know, and I'm like, come on, man, it's kind of funny, right? Like, no, nah, no, nah, it's, it's really horrific. I couldn't so see him in therapy. He's trying to get me to bring me the walls down, so, you know, I finally, one therapy session, you know, I start getting a little emotional, and then all of a sudden he goes, he goes, okay, yeah, just breathe. And the second my brain was like, ah, oh, what a douche. And I just immediately just... <laughs> <laughs> I just hey, you know, just the wall just came back up again, you know. <laughs> I don't. Maybe I'm just like, you know, maybe this is who the fuck I am. I like Corvettes, you know. Maybe I should just be this. Just start making some more money, you know. <laughs> you never think about this shit. I don't know how you guys. How do you stay married? How the fuck do you? <laughs> you do it. I know you take the happy family photo. It's just sitting there, you know. You never and just think white. that just someday, you know, just slamming the garage door in your head, putting yourself in the a guy coma for a couple of hours. Like <laughs> just all happy? Okay, evidently this is a happy crowd. <laughs> I'm the only one who thinks this shit, all right. I like fucked up shit, man. I like when crazy stuff happens. I like stuff for, like in sports. I love watching sports. Like I love all this stuff for, like people cheating, like with steroids, you know? <laughs> I am so pro-steroids. Brian Garcia I, these I days. He likes the drama. I can really yeah. give a shit, you know? I don't know what Barry Bonds is doing, but whatever he's doing, I hope he keeps doing it. I hope he just comes out as like one big chest muscle with like a back sticking out. <laughs> <laughs> he just keeps cranking him over just the fence, you know? People have been cheating <laughs> since the beginning. Since I was watching baseball in the 70s, half of them were on coke. You don't think that that helped you see the ball a little better? Be like wired out of your mind, like, dude, I can see every stick. And that's all. You're all fucking amped up. This is the shit. <laughs> Triple overtime. <laughs> no, I love all that stuff. I like when you know people fall out of the upper deck when athletes. <laughs> punch people in the stands. I mean, that's, that's just like what's entertainment for me now, you know? I like that Jimmy the Greek moment that happens in sports, you know? Like once every four or five years, you know that? Like some 50, 55-year-old white dude tries to explain why black people are kicking the shit out of white people in practically every major <laughs> sport, you know? And it always goes down the same way, right? There's always like three white dudes and the one white dude in the middle, he's always like the guy with like the theory. You know, he's always like, okay, you know, it seems these, uh, these African-American athletes, they, uh, they seem to have this, uh, this quick twitch. Not the quick twitch. This quick twitch. And the, the second quick the dude, and the second the dude says that, like the other two white dudes start like sliding on the frame, like okay, this guy's getting just fired, scientific. And I'm not just bring the science. Highlight. Nice knowing your neck. Keep that seat warm, right? And the dude in the middle, he's just like hell bent on getting fired. You know, he's just he's already so deep. He just got to make sure everyone no, 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 understands. Bring the strongest man with the strongest woman and that quick twitch. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, twenty minutes later, that dude's on TV. He's like fired, right? He's crying, his family's standing there, he's got like a box of shit from his desk with like an Emmy sticking out. He's like, I don't know what he's got, I was just talking about the quick twitch and the slow twitch, and I was, wasn't just trying to make a point. <laughs> no, I love that. I love seeing people mess up their careers like that. <laughs> it's just funny to me. Plus, I gotta admit, as a white dude, on some level, I have to believe in that theory, because it's like, a white dude's that bad at basketball? I can't even watch the NBA anymore, man. It's like every highlight, the white dude's like that. The black dude has like his nuts in his face. Fucking <laughs> I'm just sitting at home like, what for the love doing? of God, tackle the guy. Jesus Christ, get out of the way. Do you ever get tired of those two nuts flying over your head? <laughs> you know you're going to be on Sports Center. Just get the out of the way. The worst I ever got done on was by an Asian dude. He was like 6'6". Six, six, dude, so. I'm telling you, there's got to be something to that theory. I saw this show one time on Runaway Slaves. It was one of the most amazing programs I've ever seen in my life. Dude, when you ran away as a slave, you just didn't run to the end of the driveway and be like, ah, fuck that job and start walking <laughs> <laughs> He's like, F that job. <laughs> dude, you had to like run through whole states. You had to be like Forrest Gump. There's dogs chasing you, you're hurtling shit, you're swimming. 
Those were the first fucking triathletes. <laughs> and there was nobody helping him out. There was no dude on the side of the road like, come on, man, two more states, you're in Ohio. Oh. Looking good, looking good. <laughs> yeah, you, there was a war out there for real. Dude, you were no, she's on your Is it any wonder? 250, 300 years of that shit, and then I'm going to D you up in gym class? It ain't happening. <laughs> I come from hundreds of years of alcoholics. I got like half a liver, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> It's genetic, apparently. You know, about that stuff, you can't even like, you know, I obviously know that, that theory is crazy, but it's just like, you can't even bring up how well black people do, are doing in sports. Everybody gets all weird about it, which I don't understand because it's like a compliment, you know? <laughs> like, feel how weird it is right now. You know, I just brought that shit up. <laughs> I'm saying something good, right? I said, I saw a coach get in trouble for that shit. Like, his team was like 0-6 or something. They just couldn't win. And every week, the press was just getting on him more and more and more, right? And the dude, he was just like flustered. And he had like a moment of honesty. They were like, why did you guys win a game? He's like, oh, you know, oh, the offense isn't getting it done. You know, defense, you know, like, too slow. And it just wanna... So we gotta get some more black guys in this team. But I'm telling you, <laughs> and immediately, everybody's like, what, 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 what? Everyone started freaking out. Like, they had no idea what this dude was talking about. <laughs> It's like, are Couple you shut down corners. <laughs> or do you see the Olympics? Like, I love the 100-meter dash, right? There's always, there's always like, like, like nine black dudes and that, that one token white guy in, like, lane eight. He always finishes, like, <laughs> third and fourth. I'm just sitting there going, come on, man. One, <laughs> one time, just, just win the bronze. Just do what you got to do. Just win the bronze. And the white dude always stays with him to, like, the first turn, then he, like, fucking blows out. <laughs> Those other eight black dudes are like... <laughs> Not the hammy. <laughs> Where's that white dude the next Olympics? He's like up in the broadcast booth. His career's over. He's, wearing, he's like a commentator. Yeah, it's going to be a great race. Still can't feel my fucking toes, but I'm telling you. No, I don't get it. It's like a compliment. We're saying you, you, you're fast. That's a good thing, right? People start all freaking out. Oh, you're acting like that's all we can do. You're saying we can't be scientists. No, we're not. All we're saying is if there was a race through the microscopes, you fucking would win. <laughs> it's just saying... That you're fast, you get there first. Your last I saw one that one coming. I get there like three minutes later, all cramped up. Are you looking at bacteria? No, you go first. You just go first. <laughs> you go first. It was a Volvo. The guy ran by a Volvo. Well, I have to race shoes. though. I've never seen that before in my life. No, I, I get into those arguments all the time. All the time. Friends of mine will be like, well, how come anytime a black athlete does something, they say it's an athletic move. Anytime a white athlete does it, they say it's an intelligent move. And it's like, well, f fair enough, man. It just, just depends on what you're doing. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, if you read a defense, white or black, that's an intelligent move, right? But if you take off from the foul line, jump over nine other dudes and throw the shit down, those other nine guys aren't standing there like, fuck, why didn't I think of that shit? <laughs> Here I am dribbling around, guys. I think that's some superhero shit. <laughs> the wind with a big S on your chest. I'm telling you, man, that, that's the funny thing about Hitler. What? <laughs> Just name drop. Just name drop. Just what the transition? Let Hold on, let's hear that again. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, that, that's the funny thing about Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> that's the funny thing about him. Just let me finish. Let, let me work my way. Let me work my way through this idea. <laughs> no, that's my, my favorite. My favorite sports clip is that Jesse Owens shit. That switched pretty quick, man. I did not see that coming. Right. <laughs> uh, I don't know what that's about. We got one more part of the special. We're going to get into it. And I guess we're going to learn about Hitler. Yeah. So. But that was why uh, black people are good at sports and white dudes are typically not as good at sports. So <laughs> that was really funny, man. Bill Burr said it. I didn't say it. He said it. Actually, when he was talking, I was just, I don't know if y'all noticed, but I was sort oh, of you're sliding away from the reaction. Oh. <laughs> uh, we're just a young channel. We're not trying to get canceled yet. With that being said, babe, would you like to commentate on this? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was Switzerland and next to this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> nah, man, I think that the truth is, is growing up, I didn't really know anybody who wanted to be in the NBA that was like white. To be honest, it just wasn't something we really thought we could do. Me either. Kevin Garnett did go to my high school, but other than that, no. And that ain't got nothing to do with anything. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest. All right, guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. We're going to get out of here before we get in trouble. Uh, Bill Burr, that was so much fun. Thank you guys so much. All you guys are awesome. Thank you guys for being so chill at the end of the day, man. It's all good humor <laughs> over here. So I'm pretty sure we're all going to get it eventually. So let's go.